Welcome to today's video tutorial, where we'll show you how to create a stunning filterable gallery in Elementor, even without the Pro version, and the best part, we'll be using this Pro Elementor add-ins plugin. This free Elementor Gallery widget has a great deal to offer, it comes with exciting features like filter animations, hover effects and more. To get started, make sure you have the Spro Elementor add-ins plugin installed and activated on your WordPress website. After plugin activation, just make sure the simple gallery widget is enabled, so you can find it in the Elementor editor. From the Spro Add-ins dashboard, click on the Widgets tab, find the simple gallery widget, and then toggle the button on to enable it. From the Spro add-in section, simply drag and drop the simple gallery widget on your desired page location. This is the default view of the Spro simple gallery widget. Once you drop it at your desired location. Let's begin by accessing the gallery section in the content tab and selecting filter group. Filter 1, if desired, you can rename the filter or set it as your default choice when using multiple filters. To insert images, navigate to the add image section under gallery images. You can either select images from the media library or directly upload them from your desktop. Start by clicking the Advanced section in the Content tab. Here you can adjust the layout of your gallery according to your desired design. You can adjust the number of images per row. Moreover, you can scroll the height and margin sliders to adjust the height of images and the margin among them. Add caption and icons to your images in the gallery. This is another amazing feature you can use while using our free Spro Simple Gallery widget. Let's check out how to add filters to your images. Click the filter section. Here you can select three animations, 3D flip, quick sand or fade out. You can also make these compatible according to the devices where you think you will get most of the target audience, mobile and tablet. Just move towards the pop-up section in the content tab, change the options in front of the pop-up menu from none to classic, and click any of your images in the gallery. This will activate the pop-up feature. Enabling this feature will help you highlight all the details of the images.
Click the overlay section. Here you can add different hover effects to the images of the gallery. You can select from zoom, fade in, and rotate. You can also change the color of your image's background effect. Either select from the default colors options, or you can also select the color of your choice. Once you are done with adding images, you can click on the style tab to add or change icons on your images. You can use the icon sections to add icons from the icon gallery and can also upload a custom SVG from your PC. This feature also allows you to change the size, background, and color of an icon. Filter section. Here you can change the topography to make them more attractive and visible. You can even change the alignment that suits best according to your design. This widget also allows you to add hover and active effect to the filter. You can style your filter with your favorite color according to the theme of your site. It also allows you to change the background to make your text color more prominent. Click the drop-down section in the style section, toggle to responsive mode and change it to your most targeted devices like mobile. Now adjust the colors the way you want or according to your theme. I hope now you have a better understanding of how to fully utilize our amazing simple gallery widget for Elementor. If you found this video helpful, I encourage you to subscribe to our channel for more plugin review videos. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Thank you for your support.